Hey guys, welcome to my next Let's Play series. I told you this would be an RPG. Those who were watching my Mega Man knows what game this is going to be. Uh, just a little bit about it. It may have been overlooked by some back in the uh, Genesis and Super Nintendo era. Uh, this, this RPG was on the Sega Genesis. And it was actually the fourth game in the series. It's the first one I've ever played. And I enjoyed this game a lot. And I wanted to share my experience with you guys. Banshee Star, the end of the millennium. It, yeah. Can't wait to get started with it. Uh, one of the things I liked, as you see right there, real briefly, the, the cutscenes I, I enjoy a lot. They, had that anime slash uh, comic books manga style to it. And if you're a fan of, of anime like myself, uh, then this could be a game that you might enjoy, especially if you like RPGs as well. Uh, the game also gives you a little bit of a backstory here, uh, which I believe, you know, the, the story and the information you're reading here. Uh, ties into the other three Fantasy Star games that were released on the Sega system. But unfortunately I've never played the other ones and I have no intention to either. And I'm pretty sure they're pretty good games as well. I just want to play games that, you know, I grew up playing and I have some familiarity to, to them. So enjoy the, the intro here. And I want to apologize for botching up the, the last, uh, my first attempt of the recording of this for the sneak peek. Which is going to be another sneak peek. This is sneak peek take two. <laughs> so, let's begin here. I'm going to you know, jump ahead. Show what we're going to be in store for. And I'm hoping that, you know, the audio is in sync this time. I uh, don't know why the my first attempt the the file that I saved uh, the audio was intact, perfect. But once it uploaded on YouTube, it just had a horrible delay, which is not good. So let's run around here. Let's not worry about any treasure chests. Wow, that was quick. So I'll go into more detail later when we when I actually do the let's play. But let's uh, I'll touch base quickly here. So you have commands which you can manually input your tactics. So you have attack. Uh, you have technique points, which is the TP, essentially magic points, your magic spells in the game. Then you have uh, skills, which have a fixed amount of charges. Uh, as you level up, they will increase the amount of times you can use it. Then you have your items, you have defend. Uh, just attack. Uh oh. You also have macros, which is something I really enjoyed in the uh, in this game. You can basically, you know, auto select your commands and they'll do them for you. But more importantly, uh, this game has combo attacks and you can create combo attacks and set them as macros. That's how the macros work. Based on the order you have listed will be the order that the characters will execute. So the, the agility stat won't play into factor for who goes first. It's really good for setting up combo combination attacks, especially if you have like a slower character, you want to put them ahead of the faster characters. Then the chances to pull off a combo attack is greatly increased. So let's just, oh, nice whipping. Missed twice. Wow. I have to fix that. Let's use a skill. And I'll go into more in depth of how to take on bosses and so forth. This boss is pretty easy as you can 
see here, but this game gets a, a lot harder. Pretty quickly, too. Uh, so I figured this would be a good uh, game to provide a walkthrough and commentary. And should tactics of how to handle certain situations as most efficiently as possible. I'm also going to use the want to show all the combination attacks and hopefully provide when it's a good time to use them. Some of them might not be so good, but others I can see being uh, kind of useful. And when the screen flashes like that, that, that means you landed at a critical. Come on. Kill them! Kill him! Do it! Nice! Victory! Victory! Nice! A level up. Two people level up. We sure did. Sure did. I hope you enjoyed this sneak peek, and I'm really looking forward to uh, doing this for real. Have a great day, everyone.